The age of men is over. The time of the Orc has come, this time on the map, Forts of Aizen, and once again we get to play with the Mordor faction, this time against Gondor. And not double Orc pit technology this time. Something else, you know what I'm saying? So old school Orc pits only. And our goal at the beginning of the game is to protect the Lambermills. I like to build the Lambermills because I like to have the uh, wood bonus. We see Peregrine Took crossing the river. And, you know, seeing this kind of makes me feel or makes me think like that he went for the barracks pit, uh, barracks opening. Because if he didn't, uh, he will have to use one of the soldiers to grab the settlements outside. And that will mean he's going to be able to send only one soldier forward. And this push is not going to be effective. Yeah, this push is not going to be effective. You cannot hope to destroy anything with the one soldier. Don't do this. Oh, but he's going for the workers. Smart, smart. Eye of Sauron. I see. You. I knew he will be picking heal. Um, if you are not sure, don't pick anything from your spell book before you use before you see him use the heal. Because if you use the Eye of Sauron a bit too early, you can counter this by placing the Alvin Wood. But I knew in this situation, even if he did do that. He will still lose because he sent only one soldier forward. If he had both the soldiers, I would be a bit more patient with the Eye of Sauron. But, you know, it's a situational decision you need to make. Kill this Hobbit. So we need to be fast. I also will go for the Haradrim Palace later on. Because I like to have the Haradrims to creep the map. And also the Rune Soldiers to be able to actively fight for the map control. And with orcs all alone, that's going to be kind of difficult because his knights can trample the orcs over and over again. So going for the Haradrim Palace and Slaughterhouse. Go, go, go. Beautiful. Okay, now we can creep the top side first. And hopefully, hopefully that's going to be the first creep of many. Go, 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 go. Okay, so we need the Haradrims. We need the... Oh, that was not the best uh, luring. But should be fine. I wonder where his second soldier is, actually. Oh, okay. He was coming from the bottom side. But again, the same situation, you know. One soldier will need a lot of time to destroy this, but I will repair this so it won't go down. Get the money! Bring me the treasure! You can do it. Nice. Beautiful. Everything is going, doing good. Um, I think he will have his knights on the field very, very soon. Yep, 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 yep. But he's also not a very look, good looking beast. But our beast is also not looking too hot either, you know? I play so slow in this game, bro. I could be creeping at least two creeps by now, but I'm playing so slow. <laughs> okay, so we need to take as many creeps as we potentially can. Okay, so in a dream world, um, we need to get both the outposts, you know, and put Haradrims inside of them. And later on, we can go for the rune soldiers, take over the entire map. But of course, our opponent will potentially try his best to deny this from happening. So I want to creep more, if I can. We only took two creeps for now. Go now. Okay, he's coming from the top side. I think I'm assuming he crept this. Actually, he didn't. He didn't yet. I want to go for the troll cage, actually, guys. Now I want to have both the units available. I want to have the runes for the map control and the trolls to permit cheese. His knights be annoying. That's gonna be the creep number three. So 
In the worst case, it's gonna be 50 50. That's great for us because that's not the best map for Mordor. Mordor is usually a better and greater on big maps, and Fort of Eisen is just not big enough. Okay, beautiful. Three creeps secured. That's amazing. Oh, he killed the Haradrims one more time, actually. Bro, just let me buy and purchase the outpost already, man. Don't be, don't be like that. Don't be like that. Can we not make peace, you and I? And what is this? What is this gonna be called, boys? Men of the East versus Men of the West? I don't want to use it, actually. You know. It won't change anything. I will just lose this fight over there. But that's totally fine. More runes. And also we can now use industry in a second. Boom. Okay, that's going to be kind of big spike for us, though. I like it. For evil factions, that's one of the greatest... I mean, one of the earliest spikes you can get. But it's kind of it's kind of hard for us to sustain both the production buildings simultaneously. So to sustain the Haradrim Palace with the Rune Soldiers and also the Troll Kids with the Mountain Trolls at the same time, that's a little bit challenging because of the you know few settlements we have outside. And for that reason, industry is gonna come in clutch and help us out a little bit. So don't go for the trample. If you go for the trample, I will be using our Sauron, bro. Don't do this. Okay, there we go. Do it. I hope it was worth it, bro. I hope it was worth it. I will still capture it, bro. I don't I don't care, you know? I will just buy it. <laughs> oof. Yeah, yeah. Oof all you want, man. You should have just let me be. Now you lost your knights. And I still got the outpost, you know? And of course, you don't want to exchange your knights of Gondor for a Haradrim. Because, you know, let's be honest, the soldiers, I mean, the knights are way more expensive than a Haradrim warrior. So going for a one, one for one is never, never an option there. We need to pressure from the top side and with the orc pit. And also, hopefully, we can do that from the bottom side at the same time. More orc pits equal more pressure and more... Um, you know, momentum. We can chase them all the time, you know? That's what I taught you. Just keep chasing, and whenever he stops, he will be in trouble. I mean, as long as he's running away, we cannot catch him, but we can keep chasing him all the time. More map control required. Take, don't give them anything, but take everything from them. Like Leonidas would like to say from the Spartans. I mean, is he preparing to go for the, for the push? I'm not sure, but I will build towers in either case, just to feel a bit more safe. Because he has shields and also bleeds, so that kind of... It's an indicator for a potential uh, base rush. And uh, I don't think that's going to work out. I have trolls ex exactly for this for this reason. I see Boromir there, but that's fine. And now we can dodge him. Punish him. Boom on your face, son. Ooh, okay. I mean, that's not good, bro. Back, 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 back. He has the damn ranger summon, the great company. We need to eat this orc, by the way. We need to eat them to get full back to full HP. At this point, we need to stall. And hopefully we can stall until the duration of the great company is gone. Eat, eat. Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. Eat. <laughs> eat, bro. Come on, eat now. But the map is looking good for us. Um, okay, so the Great Company killing my runes, but it's totally fine. Always, yeah, exactly. That's what we need to do, boys. 
kind of force him to retreat and get let him go you know pick, let him walk back and forth and demolish the structures to not give power points that's the key and give him more targets so the rangers now have to deal with the runes and also with the trolls at the same time and we tick over the map Mordor is a faction that is macro heavy so and the rings are almost gone oh that's so good for us boys they have no more time remaining though they're gone almost go 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 away we don't like you in middle earth bro leave nice now what he dealt almost no damage to us by the way that's so good for us that's a huge cooldown on him though on him though on the great company i mean And look at the, would you look at the minimap, boys. I hope green is your most favorite color now. And more there is a time bomb, you know? The more I get, the more time I get with this much map control, the stronger I will get. But there is one rule when you play with the evil faction. At some point of the time, and this point should not be super late, you want to bring the fight to the enemy because Gondor in the ultra late game with the, their summons and Gandalf can be still extremely painful with the campy playstyle you can build multiple towers place ranges on top of the wall and it will be kind of difficult to siege through that and you need to be patient I'm an impatient person so it's not like the ideal situation for me for that reason I don't want to be wasting too much time I want to bring the fight to them so for that we need to get the troll cage level 2 first and then we will recruit the drummer troll go and i also i will attack this bottom by the way where is he i'm gonna send all my trolls to him it's gonna be a 4v1 situation so even though he's countering them but in a 4v1 4v1 you know it's gonna be a different thing i will kill you boromir And you see, we, you know, basically pumping out more and more orcs from every orc pit, you know, getting, you know, uh, in a, always in a winning spot. To, to counter these runes, you need also Faramir. Oh, Boromir, you ain't going nowhere, bro. One does not simply walk into Mordor, but one can simply walk into Gondor. Die. Should we gate rush him? Nah, 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 nah. I'm not a person like this, bro. I don't want to win like this. Go back, go back, go back, go back. I will let you live, bro. Bromia. Boromia got my Bromia. You have so much money, but obviously you know what we are saving for. It's going to be the, the, the Lord of the Nine. Minas Morgul is his homeland. Oh, I didn't send them in there, bro. What are they doing? It's an attack. Okay, they need to eat some orcs. You know, when you have trouble, when you need medicine, all you gotta do is eat some orcs. Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. Get over here. Eat. It's time. It's dinner time, bro. Buffet, you know. All you can eat almost got the witch king but i'm gonna just grab rocks now boys and i will start sieging and i will show you the power of trolls that they can turn into any unit you want the only weakness of them is that they can't deal with flying units like eagles and also of course nazgul's witch king but beside that they can deal with almost every unit with enough leadership and they can also turn into a siege weapon they can legit destroy the wall too industry okay now it's time for the like mentioned before we need to bring the fight to them that was the original plan kaboom i like the troll so much bro let's go <laughs> i like it do it again Oh, 
Oh, he used Easter Light, though. That's good for us. Where's my Witch King at? Witch King is stuck in Baradur. Go, Witch King, fly to your creatures. I want to kill this uh, kill this Ganna, by the way, guys. I want to kill him so badly. Because he took down our outpost, and that's not allowed. I will not allow this. Can't you see death? Don't you see death when you see it? What? Don't you know death when you see it? That's what he said, right? Old man. This is my hour. Okay, you want to use lightning sword on me? Get trolled. Dude, why are you walking trolls? Oh my god, they needed to walk because I think Ganav hit the high ground or something. I don't know. Ganav just turned into Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan Ganav. Ganav Kenobi. Okay, you know what? I I'm, I have enough from this, boys. I'm gonna just bring the fight to him. Because I don't, I don't want Ganav to ride through the entire map and farm power points. We need to bring the fight to them. So I'm gonna go for the for the upgrades banner and also fire arrows. Oh, fire arrows now, beautiful. Okay, so fire arrows for the worst case scenario. The worst case scenario is when he unlocks the eagles. That's not good for us. So we need to be prepared. Hope for the best, but be prepared for the worst. And we have almost darkness too. Okay, that's gonna be great, boys. Okay, you will love this. You will love this sea situation. Because we don't need catapults. You don't need rams. You don't need any of that. You have trolls with rogues. They are roguing. Oh my god, they kill my Smeagol. It's okay. We grab them rocks. Grab them rocks. Kaboom, 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 kaboom. Uh, one more time. Do it one more time. And always destroy everything from him on the map. You know, don't allow him to get any map control. Okay. I want to give them banner. Oh my god, I'm going to go in, boys. And while I'm going to fight, I think I'm going to get also the, the power points for the darkness. That's going to be awesome. He's underestimating. We need. We, we are giving him so many targets. He needs to, of course, deal with the trolls. But if he does that, the orcs and runes will smash him. And the runes will make sure that the knights don't have an easy time just trampling over them. Because if they are careless, they will trample into the rune soldiers. And then they will die. Long story short, that's going to be awesome. Let's go. Trolls are dying, but look the orc damage with this much leadership. They have 100% more damage now. Yeah, it looks like they are healing, bro. That's how much leadership they got. Send forth the legions. But they, but he has, but they have the white wizard. I will smash him. Talking about the white wizard, boys, he's coming. Yeah, right through my runes, all these boys. Let's go. <laughs> I told you, runes and order combination. All you gotta do, boy. Oh my god, the damage is crazy we are dealing. Don't you think? Okay, let's calculate this. I was around 50. Witch King 50, Drummer 50. That's 150 plus 33, uh, plus 50 from the Drummer Troll. The dark, plus 33 from the... <laughs> plus 33 from the Darkness. I can't type. A GG well play, guys. I hope you enjoyed this Mordor Masterclass. And that's how you smashed the Gondor faction. On my Force of Eisen. If it was enjoyable for you, you know what to do. I will see you next time. Until then, take care of yourself. Keep hitting like a truck. And as always, stay beyond standards. Peace out, boys.